This is the Wise Greg and Warfare Man. Today we're going to talk about the Atlas. We have a couple of builds. We, we talk about abilities. We talk about augments. So basically everything the Atlas has to, uh, has to offer. So let's go. We got a simple normal build here. We got a lot of duration. We got uh, a lot of strength. And this is this is just a build for for the beginner, you know? Just just take this build, play around with the Atlas, get a get a hold of the, the guy, just test him out, and this build is amazing for that. And uh, we're gonna test it out here. Look at that. So uh, we got two uh, two of these bastards right here, and uh, these are rumblers. We got uh, we got uh, rock that can that can roll. And uh, we can do the landslide ability, which make us uh, skate uh, across the the plane and punch our enemies with stone fist. And also, we can petrify bastards and then beat them to a pulp. And you can see all these rocks laying down on the ground. These you can pick up now. They give you health, and if you have 100% of your health, they give you armor. Check it out on the. Uh, down below on the right you can see all that armor there you go so now we know a little bit about the atlas so let's test them out in a mission so we need to uh free free a prisoner look at that i i brought my rumblers with me they are taking care of all the bastards that are trying to kill me let's go home. there you go they're they're still doing their work I freed the prisoner and uh, the warden has been petrified. Look at that. Look how easy it goes with the Atlas. The very strong bastard cannot be knocked down. So yeah. Look at that. Petrified. No trouble of you anymore. There you go. So now it is time for the abilities and the first ability is called Landslide. But we also have an augment for this ability which is called Path of Statues. So this is how we're going to do it today ladies and gentlemen. We have an ability and an augment and we're going to make a build for that. Look at that. We have the Path of Statues. So what does that do? Well, you use your Landslide, punch these bastards but these rocks are staying on the ground. And look at that. When these bastards walk over them, they get they get turned into stone. So uh I I that's how this augment got its name. The path of statue. Look at that. Look how easy that is. So this could be very uh, welcoming in a defense mission or something. Just punch a bastard in the face and everything will be okay. So let's test it out against a group of big bastards. Look at that. I just flew through the air. You can see the rocks in the air. And every time one of these bastards hit those rocks, they got turned into stone. And I can figure out how I'm going to kill them. Look at that. Look how beautiful that looks. Stones in the air. Oh, yeah. So let's test it out in, in a defense mode. Because I said so. So here we go. Look at that. I just jump and punch and they get all turned into stone. And uh, these stones, they, they, they keep laying there. And they keep laying there even more if you have more power duration. Look at that. They all turn into stone. They cannot attack the objective. I am defending and uh, everything is going great. So there we go. When you use your Petrify and Landslide in succession, you get more rocks for your armor. So now it is time for our second ability, which is called Tectonics. And basically, this is a wall to protect yourself. But now with this augment called Tectonic Fracture, you have three walls, ladies and gentlemen. So let's build a home. Here we go. We got a couple of these big bastard bombers. And uh, here we go. We're going to just... Just uh, get ourselves a nice little corner here. And there we go. We're protected. Nobody can touch us. Look at that. Look at his beauty. And these rocks, these walls, 
rock walls are pretty amazing. They, they are strong and you can shoot through them, you can walk through them, but most importantly, they protect you. Look at that. I just walk through them and shoot at one of these bastards. There you go. I'm back to my home. It's a tactic, ladies and gentlemen. But let's try that again. This time, I got a lot of infested bats. There you go. Made myself a little wall here, just like uh, Trump likes it. And uh, yeah, I, I'm keeping these bastards out. And I'm here all alone. All them are lonesome. It's very, very sad for me to be all alone. But I'm protected though. There you go. You can shoot through the walls, as I said. And you can walk through them. There you go. So, again, ladies and gentlemen, this can all be used for tactics. You can protect yourself. You can protect an objective. Long as you use a wall, it'll all be fine. So let's test it out. We got somebody to capture here. So this guy is trying to, to run away. And look at that. There you go. Nowhere to go. Look at him running. He cannot run anymore because he's stuck. Yeah, that's right. That's right. You want to run, no, run away. I'm just letting my Helios Prime kill him. Uh, I'm just standing here waiting. Look at that. He cannot run anymore because of the wall. Let's wait for a second and uh, wait for him to die because we want to see if it works. Ah, look at that. Look at that. Another tactic complete, ladies and gentlemen. It is working out A-OK. -okay. So let's go. We have a defense mission and this time we need to defend one of these bastards right here. And look at that. I, I found a room. I closed in. But he walked into a smaller room. So I thought, you know what? This is your new prison now, my friend. I'm going to protect you even if you don't want to. Look at that. So now uh, it is basically just doing a mission. You don't even have to worry about the prison. Look at that. They cannot get through. He's protected. Protected by my walls. So, um, this is maybe the best tactic with this augment and uh, this ability. Just put your uh, objective into a room and uh, protect it with walls. There you go. That, that's, the, uh, that's the answer for everything, right? Just put a wall uh, all around it and uh, you're protected. It's a very simple tactic, but I'm, I'm guessing it works. Because look at that. I'm showing you. I'm showing it to you right now. There you go. Look at all these bastards turn into stone. Now they're dead bastards. And again, I do not have to worry about the operative that, that needs to be protected because I know he's behind my wall and my walls are strong. Look at that, they're still standing. And you can make these walls stronger by using your petrified. So, oh, Petrify, our third ability. And this one is kind of cool. I think so. So, we have ourselves another build. This time with the augment called Or Gaze. And that means every time you use Petrify, you scan these bastards. But since these bastards are already scanned, uh, you cannot see the, uh, the effect. But, uh, just remember, you scan bastards when you Petrify with Or Gaze. And look at that. Look at the range of this build. All of these bastards were, were petrified with one uh, activation of the ability. Let's try that again. Behind the wall. We were behind the wall. We petrified. And let's see if one of these bastards were petrified. Look at we're going we're gonna to take... And look at that. They are all petrified, ladies and gentlemen. It works great. Still petrified. Look at that. I'm standing a bit further away. And again, ladies and gentlemen, they are still petrified. So think of that. You're walking through a mission, you use your petrify ability constantly, and you have no problem. So in a mission, bam, you petrify. You have all, your, all the time in the world. So again, just a lot of bastards all around you. Bam, petrify. 
Yeah, that's, that's right. They freeze right then and there. You don't have to worry about it. Just kick them in the balls, shoot them in the face. No troubles. Bam, petrified. That's right. What you gonna do? You're gonna do nothing. Nothing, I tell you. Oh, man, the Atlas, ladies and gentlemen. So, uh, as you can see, no trouble. We are fighting these ghouls here. I'm just using Petrify only, and uh, yeah, it works great. It's, uh, sometimes use it, and a whole group of bastards. Look at that. Look at this flying bat. I'm gonna Petrify these. Look at that. Wait for it. Wait for it. Petrified. Petrified in the sky. Look at that. That is amazing, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, that's right. We did it. So now it is time for our last ability, and that one is called Rumblers. And you've seen uh, these ones already. These are your big bros made of stone helping you out. But this time we have the Titanic Rumbler. And that means we get our big bro out. No longer have brothers. We have one brother to protect us till the end. So we got a bastard here trying to fight me. I don't like that. So here comes my big bro. Look at him. Look at him behind the wall, kicking ass. Yeah. So two rumblers become one. We have more. This one has more armor, more health. Is stronger. So yeah, I like this one a bit better. I, I called him Dwayne. And my rock jump and uh, yeah there goes Dwayne kicking ass look at that so uh, as you can see I petrified all these bastards and you can use petrify as well when your rumbler is damaged so when it is damaged you use your petrify and he gets healed up all to the max look at that and uh, when you petrify bastards and use your rumbler, you get extra rocks for your armor on uh, uh, the right hand side, as I told you. And when you destroy your rumbler, he will leave you rocks as well. But as you can see, you can easily just uh, activate your ability again for a new one. So we have seen all the abilities and all the augments and all the builds we can use for this Warframe, but let's use it in a couple of missions. And in that way I can show you how great this Warframe can be. So here we are, we have uh, our Atlas with us, and we are doing a mission on the plains of Eidolon. And uh, we just brought a couple of, uh, of abilities with us, <laughs> and uh, I used my titanic rumbler build so i can have my big friend with me and let's use all the abilities and let's see if we can use them in succession and we can use them well there we go petrify working great our rumbler is uh, doing the job it's kicking ass look at him always protecting me and again ladies and gentlemen using petrify it will be a lifesaver because uh, you're being attacked by a lot of bastards. You use Petrify and they all shut the hell up. Look at that. My Rumbler. He, he smells out. Uh, he smokes out. Whatever you want to call it. The enemy. Look at that. Another one. He can even shoot little rocks. Alright. Continue. So. There you go. Another Rumbler for us. Uh, petrify is the uh, we use landslide for even more armor rocks as i call them but that's easy look at that look at these armor rocks pick up the rocks put them on myself and that means i have armor that's how easy it can be there you go this knox bastard got petrified and then got killed now we do it we continue so uh, there we go, ladies and gentlemen. The Atlas. It is great. It can work in every kind of mission. Very great for defense. Uh, he's not the fastest one. But then again, he cannot be knocked down. You can use your uh, walls to defend upward 
objectives. You can use your landslide to kill uh, lots of enemies in a quick succession. You can use your petrified to defend yourself. And of course, you can use your rumbler to go on the offensive and uh, kill these bats. Look at that. Yeah, you scream. That's right. So there we go, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you enjoyed. Check me out in all my other videos. And I hope to see you there. And again, ladies and gentlemen, get the Atlas if you didn't have them. Have some fun. All right. Adios.